Here's me sitting here like a potato <laughs> and they're just like flawless. Oh. Hello, welcome back to Sporka Fisher here with your hosts Catherine. Fuck. <laughs> My robots died. Do you want to try again? Also, I'm Andrew. Do you want to do it again? <laughs> no, it's fine. Are you sure? I'll do it live. <laughs> I just need to go collect more baby robots. You really Because upset. my ones died. <laughs> so when my brother was born at home, yeah, from the hospital when he was a couple of days old, um, she, mom literally he was in his car seat and mom literally dumped him in the middle of the living room in the car seat to go and make me a sandwich, which was ham and pickle. I got a ham and pickle sandwich because apparently I liked that sort of shite back then. Anyway, I don't like ham and pickle now. You know? No. I like, you don't even like ham now, do you? I don't really like ham, no. Um, and I prefer chutneys to pickle. You're weird. I like some pickles. There's a lovely, I don't like pickle either. I like, you're I, I, weird. I, there's some pickles that I like. It depends on the type of pickle. And when we say pickle, we mean like... Are you saying that you're picky about your pickle, guys? <laughs> yes, I'm picky about pickles. <laughs> picky pickle. Anyway. Are you going to get them to follow you too? Yes, I just wanted to make sure that I was safe. <laughs> um, but yeah, like, like I like chutneys and stuff, and it just depends on the, on the pickle. Um, I can't stop saying pickle now. Pickle, Make pickle, me stop. Pickle. pickle. Peter Piper picked a pepper pickle. Per Peter yeah. Piper picked a peck of pickled pepper. Peck of pickled pepper. Peter Piper picked a Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled pepper. Where's the peck of pickled pepper? Peter Piper picked. <laughs> That's how you do it. <laughs> well, I'm sorry for not knowing your silly rhymes. That come out of your silly face, you silly bitch. <laughs> Just you, calm yourself there, pal. Uh, yeah, so... And then Mum went in to make herself something, came back out, and my brother, who's like one or two days old at this point, has got this weird brown stuff all over his lips. You fed your baby brother. I fed my one-day-old baby brother a pickled sandwich. <laughs> a ham and pickle sandwich. You tried to murder your baby I tried brother. To murder my, not murder. Apparently, I kept saying baby hungry. <laughs> Mum's like, what's that? And I'm like, baby hungry. Mum's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just but what's on his face? And I'm like, showing her my sandwich, going, baby, baby hungry. hungry. <laughs> so, Mum's like, oh, for fuck's sake, Catherine, you don't feed the baby. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> and of course you asked why. I do. I always ask why though, don't I? Yes. Yeah. It's something you've never grown out of. No. Nope. Much to everyone's disappointment. Yeah. Much to everyone's <laughs> horror. Oh um, yeah. Not a bad thing, I don't think. Asking why. It's why I'm good at history. Feeding the baby solid food when it's two days old, however. Yeah. Bad thing, Catherine. Andrew loved it. Okay? Andrew loved it. He's never been the same since. <laughs> Every time we you don't... bring up pickle and ham, he just nam flashbacks. <laughs> nam or nom? Nam. Nomi flashbacks. Nom. Nomi, nom flashbacks. Nomi, nomi flashbacks. Nom flashbacks. Nom 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 nom. He enjoyed it. Did he? Yeah. Did you ask? And he gave you a direct answer? He didn't spit it out. <laughs> <laughs> he probably wasn't able to. <laughs> <laughs> because he was a baby, Catherine. I'm sorry, Andrew. <laughs> He's not, you can tell. I know. <laughs> He's fine. And he has a very healthy relationship with food now. <laughs> so it's cool. <laughs> Didn't do anything that bad. Didn't damage him for life. No. Honest. <laughs> I don't think I did anyway. Andrew. Vomit. Like, comment, and subscribe, like, comment if, you're and subscribe for life. if you're damaged for life. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Hey, brother. Okay, I did it. Yay! Successfully this time. Well, have you not ever done anything like that to your sister then, I no? I believe... My sister is older than me, for one thing. So she gave you like a scar was, on your chin. She did. She scarred you for we life. a little older. Yes. Pushed me in the pool. And my chin hit the edge. And I had... Paper stitches. Did that not hurt? Of course it hurt! Oh. Did she get into trouble? 
I don't know. <laughs> I was a little busy being. I was too busy being sore. What being happened sore? to my robot? Catherine! They all went into where's it. Where's my robot? They all went into I'm it. I'm missing a robot. They all went into it. <laughs> what happened? All to seven of them went into it. There was six for one. Th what are you doing here? Why have you done this? Why haven't you followed your brothers? <laughs> Bad can, little can you, robot. Can you have more than six following you at a time? Yeah. Okay. I don't know what the maximum is, but it's probably you didn't die with six. your brothers, you coward. You didn't enter the tunnel of destiny. It's death in there, but still, destiny awaits. Go. Thank you. Attack. Kill it. <laughs> Kill it. <laughs> yeah. You're oh, my favourite. We get an even Barney. Ah, we get an even attack. Barney. Robots, help. Barney the robot. I died. Good job. Shut up. You didn't answer my question. Dog. Can we name him Barney? Maybe. Let's see. Keep going. Attack. Kill. Slay. Mutilate. Yes, queen. Yes, queen. Slay. Oh, I've got something a wee bit controversial then to talk about, just as we're talking about that. What? So, in the UK, Celebrity Big Brother's on. Uh-huh. And there's a woman in there that is a transgender. So she's from male to female. And they've put in a drag queen as well. Right. Who, if he's if he's dressed up as a woman, prefers to be called Courtney, and if he's just normal as a guy, he prefers to be called Sean, right? Um, so he's a wee bit like gender fluid in that respect. She's turned around. The transgender, the transgender has turned around and said that the drag queen makes her really uncomfortable, and she doesn't agree with it. <laughs> okay. Thoughts and opinions. She thinks That's it's fine. she. She thinks that it makes a mockery of of transgenders, but I don't see it as that. I don't think it's. I a don't mockery. think it's a mockery. I think it's just them wanting to express themselves. You know what I mean? I mean, it's okay to be creeped out. That's a thing that's allowed. Yeah. Do you not think it's a bit? I don't know. I just. I just thought it was a bit strange the fact that she's given the fact that she is male to female that she would be more supportive of do you know what I mean? Yeah you would think so I, get, I think everyone's entitled to their own opinion on things yeah. though like. but I'm quite a shallow person I would only go out with a guy who was a drag queen as long as they weren't as pretty as me as a girl <laughs> well you'd be hard pressed oh <gasps> <laughs> oh, oh, oh! That was heartful. Oh, oh! I quit. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> oh. But you know, what I mean, like you get the guys like RuPaul and all that. Even the guy Sean that, that's playing that, that that that's Courtney. Like they're just beautiful, and it's so heartful. It's so hurtful that these men are prettier than you. It's hurtful that they're not only really gorgeous and good looking when they're not dressed up, and then they dress up and they're all beautiful and they're like, yeah, God, they probably work really hard to they look do. That they way. do, they do. But when they're not, even when they're guys and they don't, you know, I mean, wear makeup or anything, they're still good looking. And I'm like, God damn it! Here's me sitting here like a potato, <laughs> and they're just like flawless. Oh. I don't know. Cities are full of smog. If you're a drag queen, what would you call yourself? Um, Andrea, probably. Andrea? Because it's yeah. very close to my regular name. No. Looks like we're going on holiday, Catherine. Nice. Oh, so we can breathe underwater. <laughs> I do love the humour in this game. Oh, I know, it's good. So come to Joe Eye Resort and leave your world and your troubles behind. Can do, friend. We're going on an adventure. Yay! I'm going on an adventure. Oh come on! Switch off your nerd circuits and have some fun. 
<laughs> yeah, just long enough to pick up the O2 mask. We wouldn't stay forever. Oh, back to sassy clank, I see. Oh, oh man, they are not oh, happy man. with one another. They are, they are getting bitchy. <laughs> oh man, in the next episode of Sporkerfish, we get we go beachy. on holiday. No, no, do it again. In the next episode of Sporkerfish, we, we go get... on holiday. No, in the next episode of Sporkerfish, we get. Beachy! On holiday!